Sally has faced off with some huge opponents in the past. Benji Toe comes to mind right now, and she's faced off with some tough, tough challengers. But just in terms of sheer size, Puff might be the biggest opponent she's ever been in the ring with. Puff very attuned and very well versed in the rest inter intergender wrestling. So we'll see what he has here for Sally. Tell me, Marky Mark and Dr. Bob, how could you possibly prepare for Puff knowing you're going into that to face Jody Threat? I was just about to ask you the exact same thing, Smarks. She had a mindset going into this, expecting to face Jody Threat in the very last minute. Puff came into the picture. How does one prepare for this, Dr. Bob? Well, you gotta be a constant professional. You gotta prepare for anything and be ready for anything. Sally is that she knows how to face some of the toughest in the business. I don't know if they taught how to dance in the village of the dam, though. Maybe zombie walk, perhaps. I thought it was just uniquely known that everyone can do the thriller in the land of the dead. That might be our, our Halloween show. This match is officially underway here. Puff is going to have the size and, of course, strength advantage in this one. This one's sure. And the dance moves, Bob after bar. Don't forget about that. I don't know if dancing wins matches, but definitely sells merch. Dancing is cardio, Bob. Dancing is strength. Dancing is power. Sally is a much faster to, of course, and go behind. I don't know. She can't reach around him. She's not going to be able to suplex him. No waist lock there. going to find the waist first, Bob. I think I know what Puff's going to do here. Duke and a driving classic puff. And one. And two. Bam! Down goes Sally. The nice rear ender by Puff. I got a big one. Is that a jab at the car crash? I'm gonna get you though. One of the fuck game buffalo brother. Whoa! Outside the ring. Lands on his feet though. Spills out on the floor. I don't know if you've known this, Bob, but over the last several weeks, there have been numerous earthquakes in the Seaway Valley. Could have been the impending puff. <laughs> Referee Emily Parker. Oh! Puff in shock! Give that man a breather! What a slap. Oh! Sally Trey shot to the best of them. Not afraid of Puff. Referee Emily Parker up to a four count here. Got to Sally Sally. did break it. I really gotta wonder at what point Bill Murray, Ernie Hudson gonna bust down the door and help us deal with this Puff man. Give us a sponsorship. I'm taking a breather, taking a seat here. Puff's trying to hide behind the Sea Valley Wrestling crowd here. But Sally's not blind, folks. Sally's going to go coast to coast there. Oh! Back first into the ring post. Up to a four count. The hands of Puff know what he's going for. This doesn't work out well. Very Ric Flair-esque. He's going to go. Breaks the count. Kind of. And he's going for the tour of the world here. The crowd behind Puff here. Let's see if the man's really got his cardio. I did see a lot of gyms here at the NAF Center, Dr. Bob. I might be a, a fortune teller because this is not going to work out well. How far is he? Usually, the bases. usually gets around three quarters of the way. Oh, over there, almost. He needs some water. Get Puff some water. I don't run that much here. <laughs> Puff no longer wants to run here, actually pushing Sally and taking a break. Asking the Sea Valley faithful here for some water. I don't think that's water. Oh, oh I really hope there weren't any kids there. There's one. Welcome to Cornwall, baby. Referee back up. I believe a two count here, trying to get order, regain order, and get this match back inside the ring. I think the bigger question here, Mark, is is Sally going to be able to get Puff back in the ring? He rolls well. Finally got restored order here. This, this might be where Sally wants Puff as well. On all fours or on his back, otherwise she might have an issue. 
of a very tactical question for you here, Dr. Bob. Now, when Sally goes to complete the pin, if her is not able to completely cover Puff, are we going to account this? Emily Parker clearly is. Well, with both of your shoulders, and then that's a pinfall, regardless of where you're on your opponents. Crowd getting behind Sally here. Gonna get back on the offense. Bring a punch to her opponent. Feet. And this is where Puff's gonna struggle. He's gonna try to stay up here because the match has worn him down quite some bit. Still up. He's dancing. You can't knock him down. Look at him, Penadrill Jenga board. Jenga tower. Back up. Weebles wobble, but they don't fall down, Mark. Is it third time the charm? Touch to the clothesline. Oh! Down goes Sally hard. A tilt the world face plant slam there. This is trouble. Sally's, Sally's got to get out the way. What is Puff It's going to be the end of the That's matchup. Is she not a move? Oh! A train wreck in the corner. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. The brutality we are seeing here, Mark. And the big man from Buffalo is clearly in the driver's seat, but Sally's gone. The smart move, get out the ring. Puff clearly not knowing what's happening here, not keeping his eye on his opponent, Bob. Does it happen often? I've been celebrating this slightly too early. Only Parker also confused, trying to help Puff look for Sally here. They're both not sure. Sally, come here, what are you doing? Oh, the black mist! He's blind, Puff can't see anything! This is the moment! She needs to put him away here! That's the roses! She has to go for the cover here! What? She usually finishes off her matches! Is she going for She's not going up top, is she? What is that? A picture perfect moonsault! Here we go! Oh! That has to be it. One, two, three. It's over, folks. Sally victorious.